Hey guys, how's it going? So today in the mail, I got something that I completely forgot I had ordered. Doki Doki Literature Club Plus, the physical edition for the Nintendo Switch. There's some extra little goodies inside, so let's open it up and check it out. All right, here is the game case and the spine. And on the back, enter the number one psychological horror experience. A terrifying world of romance and poetry awaits. All right, so here is the new content, six new side stories and 13 additional music tracks. Inside, we've got the goodies. And I wasn't sure what to expect, but I'm actually kind of happy to see that they fit everything inside of the game case. Kind of save a little bit of space that way. Here we have a Metaverse business card. Now I haven't played this game yet, so I don't know all of the details. I did see a couple spoilery things though, so you know, I, I got a general idea of what happens in the game. This looks like uh, cardboard standees. I guess these are all the main characters. It's got their names on here too. It's a pretty thick cardboard material. So yeah, let's go ahead and punch these out and put them together, see what it looks like. All right, so there they are, looking pretty cute. And here we have, um, some sort of a paper ah it looks like a poem uh, now again I haven't played this game yet I know the major plot points but I don't know the characters or what kind of goes on between those major plot points so I don't know what the significance of this poem is if there is one um, but I'm sure those of you that have played it probably know so the trim on the paper itself is printed with uh, metallic gold, which is pretty cool. Looks very nice. Next we have stickers. So these are printed on a glossy material and there isn't anything on the back. So here is the soundtrack download. I had to go to the website to download this, and it's just on a piece of paper that looks like a floppy disk. So they used like a silver paint where the metallic areas of the disk would be, which is kind of cool. It's a neat little effect, but yeah, it's just paper. And here we have the membership card. So this is the Literature Club member card. This is made out of a hard plastic. And there's a spot for you to write your name and favorite color and word. There's not too much on the back here, but I'll bet we could probably write on this with a dry erase marker. All right, I'm going to fill this in here. Uh, you could, of course, use a Sharpie or a permanent marker if you want it to stay. But uh, yeah, we're just we're just playing around here. Of course, you can, yeah, with the dry erase marker, of course, you can just wipe this right off if you want. And look at that. You can just put this right in your wallet. <laughs> Here is the inside again and the back of the game case. The game card. Let's go ahead and check it out. And it looks like we do have a day one update. All right, so they start you off right away with a whole bunch of trigger warnings. I'm sure most of you already know what this game is about, but uh, for those of you that don't, I'm not going to spoil anything anyway. Just wanted to uh, just mention that it, yeah, it it's deep. It's it, the subject matter is pretty deep. Now playing the game. Uh, I'm actually really liking the characters. This was really well written and I'm actually really enjoying the poetry. I find it actually interesting. I feel like I'm learning something too about the uh, the poetry. It's it, it, This first part of the game is actually really, really good. Um, knowing what is eventually going to happen kind of makes me uh, a little bit sad but also a little excited too because it'll be interesting to see how they work that in. Um, but yeah, really like this so far. Um, I'm glad I waited, you know, even though 
yeah, now I already kind of know uh, basically what happens. Um, I'm, I'm still glad I waited uh, because now we've got this plus edition and I just generally like, I prefer playing games on console. If you want to play this on PC, now the original game, the very first original game, that's free to play. You can just download it and play it, see if you like it. But the plus version that has the additional content, um, this obviously costs money now. And and I don't mind su you know supporting the developers and you know paying for their efforts and stuff like that. And I just really wanted to play it on console anyway. Now, one thing I will point out though is that the this is all the physical version is also available on PlayStation 4 and 5, but the PlayStation versions have been censored. Um, it's not too big of a censorship but and I, without it's hard to even talk about it without getting into spoilers but um it is censorship uh the nintendo switch version is completely uncensored and the xbox version and pc version are all completely uncensored so if you get doki doki literature club plus um i if you don't mind the censorship go ahead and pick it up on playstation but otherwise i would recommend picking it up on either switch xbox or pc all right, guys, that is going to do it for today. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I will see you later.